it was odd because we had a, a lot of guys in that defense that their names started with B. I mean, myself, Betters, Baumhauer, Brzezinski, the Blackwood brothers, Charlie Bowser, and uh, and it's kind of unfair because it, it, you know, we were all the guys that kind of got the posters and other things, and you know, you, like A.J. Dewey was left out, and uh, Gerald Small, and some of the other guys were kind of left out. So it was, uh, it, it was fun, but uh, still, I, I kind of every now and then I see one of those posters and I, I, I cringe a little bit. Lyle and Glenn hanging from a goalpost in B's uniforms, and we all had the B outfits on and everything. It's. Uh, it's one of those things you do at a time and it was fun and now you look back on it and you say, man, what was I thinking about? The steel curtain, the fearsome foursome, the purple people eaters, and not that I'm comparing our group to those groups, but you know, whenever you, you stick a, a name to, uh, to a group, it, it, kind of, it kind of sticks. You know, the Dolphins had the no-name defense and then the Killer Bees. And you know, it's, it's funny, every year when a defense starts to play well, someone tries to find a name for it. And, you know, off times they come up with something, but it doesn't stick, and this one stuck. So yeah, it kind of, kind of gives us our little place in, in Dolphin lore. That's uh, that's kind of fun. Yeah, I think the one game that sticks out in my mind is the AFC Championship game against the Jets, uh, because you know Jets always a, a fierce rival for the Dolphins, and still are a fierce rival of the Dolphins. And then whenever you can beat the Jets, it's always, uh, uh, you know, it's always uh, special. You know, and we beating them twice that season and then you get the chance to play them for the right to go to the Super Bowl in the, in the Orange Bowl and you know AJ Dewey had the three interceptions and it was a, a game fought in the mud it was a, a slugfest and to come away with a win like that against the Jets to propel you into the Super Bowl couldn't be anything better than that. You expect so much going into the game and then to to come out with a loss, it's, uh, it's, it's still it's gut-wrenching to me. I can't watch the films. I still to this day uh, couldn't, couldn't sit down and watch a videotape of one of those games. I just, I just, I just won't do it, you know? And it's, uh, uh, you know, it's, it's, hard, it's hard to understand, but, you know, having been there and having gone through it, uh, the only thing that sticks in my mind is, you know, I'd rather not go than to go there and lose. I could have spent 10 years playing with the Cincinnati Bengals, and it's no slide on the Bengals, but. Uh, you know, when you walk in and you say, hey, who'd you play for? You say the Dolphins, people kind of sit up and take notice and, you know, there's some pride to that and I think you carry it with you and uh, uh, it's, a, it's a special organization. It always has been, it always will be and uh, I think anybody that's walked through these doors that's had a chance to, to put on that uniform, they've always got something they can, you know, they can lean back on that's, uh, that's, that there's a lot to be proud of.